Hello, and thank you for taking time to watch this informational video provided to you from the Western Pavement Maintenance Association. My name is Sam Hodson, and I am a project lead for the WPMA. And this informational video is all about ARAM, known as Asphalt Rubber Aggregate Membrane. And for your residential slurry projects, we call this an ARAM Cape Seal. And for your overlay projects, where you might do a grind and cap, ARAM is called a composite interlayer. And the ARAM goes down the exact same way regardless of the project. So first we see the asphalt rubber being sprayed down onto the surface at a rate between 0.55 to 0.65 gallons per square yard as per Green Book. Soon after the asphalt rubber has been sprayed down onto the surface will be the aggregate chip. And this is a 3 8 aggregate chip membrane that's being applied and it's pre-coated and preheated and as per Green Book will go down between 28 to 40 pounds per square yard. Once the screenings have been applied you will note that there will be a two-part rolling process and that is divided up this way. A minimum of four passes with pneumatic rollers and a minimum of two passes with a steel drum roller with no vibration. And once the rolling is completed, a vigorous sweeping of the loose screenings will be picked up and be driven on until you're ready for the type 2 slurry or the conventional overlay or our latest paving strategy with ARAM using sustainable thin lift over ARAM. So here's a picture of a maintenance project using ARAM with a type 2 slurry and ARAM as a composite interlayer below the cap. And our latest project using sustainable asphalt called HiRAP over the ARAM system. Thank you very much for watching this informational video on ARAM. If you have any questions, do reach out to us via our webpage or this phone number. Thank you very much.